One of the things that that has always been interesting to me is our our need as the black church to be this space of liberation, um, even if not everybody was participating, right? So that, that's a part of why you have people today saying, oh yes, and back then we were X, Y, Z. But there were a few churches who were bold enough to participate and we're thankful for those. There were, and I was just sharing about this recently that very often there were other black churches who didn't participate for, for good reasons. Their mortgages could have been called immediately yeah. for participating if yeah. they didn't fully own the church right out right insurance could have been canceled immediately right the church bombings that were happening could have mm -hmm. been immediate so the fears of black so churches important. even opening up their doors for a mass meeting well it made some sense but i'm so thankful for the ones who did especially the ones that were large enough to allow people from other churches to make their way into those doors and get the support that they needed very often mass meetings were on mondays right giving you what you need to make it throughout the rest of the week so there was tons of singing that would take place during these mass meetings within those black church spaces tons of praying that would take place within those spaces before the speaker or the preacher got up that's what gave the people what they needed to keep making it forward. And so within the singing, you have people who are changing the lyrics of songs immediately in that moment. It was organic. They weren't passing out sheet music and saying, OK, well, right now, this is how we're going to sing about, you know, have faith if you go to jail. They just made the song up in the moment. And that is how we get a chance to see their theology. How is it that they understand God operating in this moment that can give each other next to them the support that they need, the encouragement that they need to go another day of standing up for justice? So mm. the black church plays a great role, um, but it's not it's not that everybody was participating. The black church also, though, became this space for organizing so that you could meet in the basement of a church, right? You could have strategy sessions there at a church. You could have pastors who were connected to some of the other organizations. So I give the example um, within the book of Mount Teeman AME in Elizabeth, New Jersey. And that pastor, Reverend Watts, who is doing this work along with the NAACP there and encouraging his congregants to get active, saying, yeah, God can do some things, but we've got to do it too.